Last time on Night and Day. Pop out, <laughs> like eat somebody's throat and then <laughs> skitter back away <laughs> into the Walmart. Neither the skittering guy will come in there. <laughs> just destroy him, the entrails everywhere. It'll <laughs> clean up on aisle two. <laughs> This is also from, like, after humanity has ended, so they don't have sirens anymore. They just, like, stick their head out of the car. <laughs> Woo! Woo! Oh, man. So, um, oh. yeah. If you guys happen to be around in a zombie apocalypse, I, I gotta say, be careful. Like Travis said, maybe you need to stay away from Walmart for yeah. a little bit before you return as the conquering hero and exactly. reclaim it as your own so you can use it as a fort it's not gonna really have the supplies in it that you'll be looking for unless you know if you do get there you know early days you just you gotta come in with the full armament you can't yeah. go there looking for supplies like what everyone else is doing you just go in there you know looking to stake your claim yeah yeah exactly that's what i'm thinking as well it's like if you go in there looking to grab supplies, you've already lost. Yes. Like you basically have to, uh, you have to uh, take out whoever's running out with supplies, take their supplies, and then hold up into that Walmart until the end of days. Apparently, because I mean, no one's gonna find a cure inside of a Walmart, but at least you'll live a decent life. <laughs> You could have these objects there that you could trade for a potential cure. That's true. Depending on how I e mean, economical you are with spending everything or using up all the supplies inside. It is true. I mean, you could also, like, if you have access to the roof, you could just, like, Walmart has gardening stuff. You could just make a garden on the roof. Oh, yeah. And you don't have to go anywhere. You just got vegetables all day, every day. Until, like, the roof caves in. Until, because yeah. it's not really meant to hold all that. <laughs> <laughs> until, yeah. Un well, until the structure starts to fail. But then, by that time, you'll probably be dead. So. Why the roof? Why wouldn't you just go outside and put the garden out back? Because it's less safe. <laughs> it's, like, ground level. People oh, yeah, just, yeah, yeah. You have the high ground with the roof. Yeah, exactly. But you'd need a team. You couldn't just yeah. like, be the one-man sniper for days. and like, oh, Tomatoes are so good. Nah, 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 nah. Because <laughs> as soon as you were like, oh, and then people would be like, and you're just <laughs> sniped from the Walmart that's obviously like, <laughs> <laughs> from like another Walmart <laughs> from another building that's not a Walmart. This is equally as present as Walmart. So McDonald's. Or Sam's Club. I don't know Sam's Club. <laughs> Are there lots of Sam's Clubs? Sam's Club is basically the wholesale version of Walmart. Oh. They're owned by the same company. Okay. Yeah. I thought that those wholesale places, what were they called? There's like BJ's. BJ's. Yeah. Uh, yeah, BJ's and Sam's Club and Costco. Costco, that yeah. was the one. I, yeah, okay. Yeah, yeah. Costco, that used to be the the. That was like the a, the upper echelon in in wholesale. <laughs> I didn't know there was such a thing. <laughs> of I it's guess like of only wholesale, ultra posh know. wholesale clientele. Like, mm, yeah, so <laughs> would you like three hundred pounds of cocoa puffs today, sir? Hmm. What year are those Coco Pops? <laughs> How long are they going to last me? You, sir, are not distinguished enough to shop within the hollowed halls of Costco. I'm going to have to ask you to leave this establishment, sir. All right, then. I'm taking my Coco Pops with me, douche. <laughs> sir, it's not the apocalypse yet. That was another part of this story, sir. <laughs> Oh, fuck. I'm uh, going to jail. <laughs> <laughs> that same deputy. Yeah. Yeehaw! Yeehaw! <laughs> Siri! <laughs> I, don't, I don't know where this Costco is. It's like somewhere in the well, middle. you said it's like up right side. Right, I'm just questioning it. Like, it's obviously on the top of a majestic mountain overlooking a, a waterfall. I'm just picturing... Well, it seems like based on clientele and employees, <laughs> it's somewhere in between London and Texas. <laughs> or it's just, you know, yeah, it's in scenic Scotland or New Zealand and like there's a Texan visiting. Yeah, I guess. Maybe not Texas. I was getting more like Alabama from this. That's, yeah, that could be. Alabama, Georgia. 
I'd say more Alabama. All right. I'd see that as Alabama. Yeah. All right. We've we figured um, out the mystery. Yeah, we finally got there. <laughs> Took a long time. <laughs> a lot of wholesale clubs, but we got there. <laughs> so I guess um, the moral of the story is... <laughs> If there is a moral to this story, <laughs> don't go to Walmart unless you're willing to kill everyone in there for your supplies. If it's an apocalypse. If it's an apocalypse, yes. Yeah. Only, only if it's an apocalypse. Currently, you can go to Walmart. As much as you like. But wear a mask. But wear a mask and don't kill anyone. Be safe. Don't harm anyone. And uh, yeah, don't be a monster. <laughs> don't be yes be considerate of your fellow man yeah even if you're younger and you don't think that you know you're likely to contract covid you may or even if you contract it it won't cause any significant side effects to right. you it still can actually younger people can it's lower likely but yeah. it, it, it can still f your life be, yeah still don't want want to be one of those like oh only two percent of younger people die right it looks like i'm safe you could be two percent pretty quickly yeah, but regardless so, of that, don't yeah. be an asshat. Yeah. It can, you can catch it and give it to other people. Yeah, exactly. So, you know, be nice and considerate to not kill everyone around you who may actually die. Instead of being all like, well, you know, not everyone is 23. <laughs> I don't know why he's, he's reminiscing that way. Yeah. He's, <laughs> but he's he is. Like a third of his life away. It's like... <laughs> Oh, I remember when I twenty three, and he's like ninety years old. That one year must have been super epic, though. If he's just remembering twenty three. Oh, it's on a loop. Yeah, yeah, exactly. His glory day is just twenty three. It was a singular day. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> I remember the nineteenth of May <laughs> when I was twenty three. Oh, but so- you, you guys out there in, I can't see where my fingers point. I gotcha! You guys out there. Oh, I found you. Don't think you can run from me. Don't be cruel to a heart that's true. And also, wear a mask. That, was the, that, that yeah, wasn't the moral of the original story. Not that the was original. the moral at the end of the story. Yeah, what yeah. was the moral at the, at the outset of the story? I think the moral of the outside was the whole Walmart and uh, don't go there. No, before that. Oh. What brought us to Walmart? <laughs> before the apocalypse. No, the apocalypse brought us to Walmart. Where yeah. did we start this one? I don't remember. Yeah, yeah, I, don't, I can't, I can't recall either. We just went through so many different rabbit holes. I feel like we're in Alice in Wonderland now. Huh. <laughs> All right. Well, maybe the Mad Hatter will invite us for some tea. Maybe, maybe, for sure. That sounds like fun. Sounds like a nice cup of dirt water. <laughs> <laughs> yes the callback anyway we should continue on with our thing yeah yeah that's a good idea see you guys in the future yes hopefully not in an apocalypse i yeah. lost my hand hopefully on better terms yes <laughs> you that's the one <laughs> you see him travis oh yeah i see him that one right? hard to miss <laughs> not that one <laughs> yeah, that one. <laughs> oh, <laughs> oh! First minute there, I you. Thought I thought I was going psycho. <laughs> I see all these people now. <laughs> I can even hear their voices in my head. <laughs>